Hi, this is Eric Martin with Board Game Geek. I'm here with Eric Myers from WizKids looking at Blade Runner 2049, uh, designed by Travis Chance and Jesse Wright. Uh, or what are we doing in this game? It, it, it's interesting to see a game based on this movie yes. with a long sequel, which it's, it's yes. interesting to see the sort of the arc of uh, a movie title and exactly. games that derive from that. Well, if you're a, a fan of, of Blade Runner, Blade Runner 2049, uh, this is the perfect game because it's a, uh, it's a kind of logic deduction puzzle where you're playing as a Blade Runner, trying okay. to figure out who the replicant is. All right. But the replicant might be you, and you might not know it. Okay. So it starts out as kind of that tricky logic puzzle, but it may, kind of becomes a social deduction game. Because if you find out you're the replicant, suddenly you've got to figure out how to uh, escape. But if you figure out that someone else is, suddenly you've got to try to collect capture. evidence and track them down. All right. Exactly. So everyone starts out with one evidence card that's an innocence card. Um, it plays three to six, so we're going to have kind of a ghost third player. Mm -hmm. um, so you can look at your, evidence, your own evidence card whenever, and you know that that person is not the replicant. Okay. Um, amongst these cards, every character has two cards of their color, um, but the replicant has three. So once okay. you figure out who's got three cards, you know who the replicant is, and you can try to catch them. Okay. Um, the way that you'll play is that um, in turn order, uh, you pick up your character token and place it on one of these informants. Um, so I'm going to pick this bystander, who's going to let me look at two evidence cards. I'll pick it. I'll look at this one. Now I need to put down a note that says who that card isn't. That's part of the rule for when you look at a card. Right. So that gives you a little bit of information, but you still don't know who, uh, who's underneath it, as I do. Okay. And then I'll look at that one, and I will again put down a marker for who that isn't. And now it will be your turn to select an informant that's not already taken to uh, uh, go after. Okay, and I can... Uh, reveal an evidence card, so you, can I reveal something that's already been looked at by you? You absolutely can, yeah. Okay. okay. Uh, so, uh, an informant, and do not place Yes, an so this lets you look at one without putting an evidence token. All right. Okay. Done that. Um, then this person would, uh, then the third player would do something. Let's say they go there. Um, they're going to reveal one evidence card and take it, so they'll check out that one, and they'll move it there. Okay. Um, so now we all know what that card is, but they have it in their evidence pile. So um, if this person turns out to be the replicant, um, they already have one of the uh, uh, they already have one of the evidence cards they would need to catch him. Though actually, since that's this character as well, they're going to hope that they're not the replicant, um, you know, because they're going to want to try to escape, of course. Okay. Um, once everyone's on informant cards, you take the pieces off, and now that's the new turn order. Okay. Um, this central pile is Rick Deckard's pile. Um, Rick Deckard's in every game. Um, and could be the replicant. Uh, so it kind of adds a little extra wrinkle in that you know, that kind of extra player that it could be. Okay. And so that's you, the new turn order. You mentioned trying to escape. Of course. If you discover I'm the replicant, how do I do that? Um, so if anyone collects two evidence cards, including yourself, then you're caught. Um, because either someone two caught you by... Two evidence of me. Exactly. Because okay. if someone uh, collected two evidence, then they know where you are. If you collected two evidence, then you know that means you're kind of being a little shady by... Uh, hiding too many things. You want nobody to have two evidence pieces of, uh, of your type. Okay. Um, and that's going to require some doing because since Rick Deckard starts out with all the evidence, he definitely has uh, two evidence for of the uh, replicant. Okay. But they are not revealed, so no. it's hidden there. But you can also reveal exactly. evidence for him? Um, well, you can reveal evidence in his, uh, in his case file. Okay. Um, you know, you, whenever a evidence uh, card has three marks on it for what it isn't, it's automatically revealed. Okay. And also things get revealed from the uh, various informant abilities. Okay, so if I look at this again, then I could put this token on it exactly. if that were true. Exactly. And we go on. And then if that. someone else does, it would be revealed for everyone. Okay. So again, it's like that logic puzzle. You'll figure out eventually um, who's got two cards versus who has three through process of elimination or just memory. Um, and then you'll be able to catch that replicant or try to escape. All right. Thank you very much, very much Eric. Overview of Blade Runner 2049, I believe, out now. Um, it's coming out, out in soon. April. April 2020 from WizKids. Thank you very much. Thank you.